In this video, I'm going to show you how you can upload artwork to Artsonia using your personal device. The first thing you need to do is to take a picture of your artwork. If you're on a Chromebook, click on the circle button at the bottom and type in camera in the white search bar. On the left hand side towards the bottom of the screen, there's a little timer button. Click that so it's on. It'll give you three seconds to take your picture. So that way you can click your circle button and hide behind your picture. Hold it nice and still for the three second countdown. After you take the picture, it'll show up on the screen. Click on the X at the top right. Now we're going to go to our Google Classroom to access the link for Artsonia. Go to the waffle at the top and click on Classroom. Then get to our art class for whatever grade you're in. Where you see upload your art, click on the link below where it says artsonia.com class access. Once you click on the link, it's going to open up to an Artsonia portal. Sign in with your school access code. This is how we're going to get in. You can copy the code by going back and forth or highlighting and clicking on control C and then control V. Once you enter the code, click on the blue login button. Now you're gonna click on your grade level. Once you click on the grade level, click on all students. Then start typing in the first few letters of your name. Click on your name, and then scroll down to school projects. Click on the gray plus sign where it says our project name. Then you're gonna click on the green add artwork button. Select image video in blue. On the sidebar, find where it says images. It might also say pictures, so click on images or pictures and the top one will be your picture that you recently took. Click on the blue open button. Then click on the green upload now button. Now we're gonna crop the photo. We're actually gonna click on distort, which is the black box that's not perfect with all the circles on the edges. This allows you to move every corner to the picture of your art because your picture is not going to be a perfect square or a perfect rectangle. So it's easier to just move the corners to each part of your art and then click on crop at the top. This flattens the photo. Then you're going to click on save, the green button at the top right. You can add a title to your art or click on skip title. Same thing with an artist statement. You can write about your art or click on skip statement. It'll bring you to this page, which means you uploaded your art. Great job. Now at the top right hand side, you're going to click on log me out and you're all done. And I cannot wait to see your art project.